the law I am trying to help us that we now must turn our living world to this, as it is so magnificent uh, in the present action tonight. And we need everybody's attention in doing that. The second thing that I'm hoping to spend more of my time doing uh, is uh, the one earlier I mentioned, which is figuring out who we are. Now, the great questions of philosophy, existential philosophy, what Paul inscribed across his time masterpiece. They're very simple, they're very powerful, and they somehow, we turn away from them, including the philosophy, turn away from them, you know, like turning away from the Gorgon. Somehow it's just watched them too closely. Um, and these three questions are where did we come from, who are we, and where are we going? Well, philosophers uh, could not answer that. Science is beginning to answer it, and I'm not being dismissive of philosophy, because philosophy will be playing an important role in the future, but it actually seems to be within our grasp to explain where we came from and who we are and then face that. And only when we do that will we answer the third question of the Tahitian masterpiece, uh, and that is, where are we going? There was a French uh, writer, no one ever heard of him, but named Paul Bercourt. His real name was Jean Bruyer, and he put it nicely a few years after Volcan. He said, all men come from the fact that we do not know who we are and cannot agree on what we want to be. So these are the challenges I think now that we can meet and we cannot meet them with science alone. And I hope you'll agree you can't make them with meet them with art alone. But we can meet them, sir, with art and science alone. Thank you so much. <laughs>